the Sports Vote Campaign Podcast. Invest in sports. Hello and welcome back. Today is Sunday, June 5th, 2022, and this is the Sports Vote Campaign Update Podcast, Season 4, Episode 17, Masonic System of Satan. So here's a probably little known uh, fact with a couple of very small exceptions. Lawyers and their clients can plead lies. Listen to this. It's called immunity. Can plead lies in court cases without liability. Stop and think about that. Lawyers and their clients are not liable for false statements made in legal cases. Isn't that neat? Think real hard about that. So, in the Bible it says clearly in the testimony of two or three witnesses, a matter shall be established. Um, in the case of the Leon matter from 10 years ago, where, where are those witnesses? How many witnesses are there? Okay, so you're breaking God's law, and that's the only law that matters. Man's law comes and goes. And frankly, at this point, if it's not clear to everybody with what's happening in our society, we're very, very close to a fracture. So uh, we're, we're doing a fine job of screwing everything up, shooting after shooting after shooting. I mean, I can't even keep track of them. We're like two a day now? Is that where, is that where we are? So there was a movement to ban stock trading in, you know, in Congress, um, but it failed again. Now, think about that. Congress can trade stocks and Congress can make laws that affect companies. <laughs> if that isn't the absolute uh, definition of insider trading, there is no such thing as insider trading. Um. The U.S. Constitution clearly establishes that uh, a person is entitled to due process and that in the case of a court uh, lawsuit of any sort, criminal or civil, that both sides must be heard and that free speech and all the rest, even that applies. Um, very clearly that didn't happen in my case. Uh, you can try to wordsmith, lie and spin that any which way you want, but there's just simply... It just simply didn't happen, okay? It just didn't. And not only did it not happen, it was prevented from happening, and that's all in the record. So you can lie to yourself as much as you want, but it isn't going to change the facts. Um, <laughs> no such thing as a right to trial, yeah. Uh, Congress can trade on inside information. Uh, these are not only violations of our founding laws, but they're clear breaches of the laws of God that will not stand. It's only a matter of time before this system com completely collapses unless it repents from these behaviors. So to simplify this, they can make laws that they want, profiting themselves, and you have no recourse. Remember that um, in though, even though God's law and the Constitution both says both sides of a matter must be heard, um, unless you pay a lawyer and you pay enough because it's a peck, there's a pecking order there. Um, who knows how much you have to pay, but unless you pay the right firm, the right amount of money, which is a mysterious figure, then you don't even have a chance. So this is exactly as Ace has said a long time ago, probably 15 years ago, that it's the most expensive and complex bribery machine in the history of the world. That's exactly true of the United States legal system. Exactly. He nailed it long before I was willing to even entertain the idea. Nobody's ever going to convince me otherwise. I've been deep in the trenches of this for more than 15 years, given the benefit of the doubt at every turn, only to be shown wrong over and over, stabbed in the back over and over. Um, bottom line, I heard this from a pastor of uh, 53 years of the same church, which was started around the time I was born, and, and coincidentally, or incredibly in the same city as uh, Ace's studio. It is a comprehensive system of complex evil. It, that's, that's, that's a pastor of 53 years in California said this. Okay? Um, 
His name is John MacArthur. Look him up. So when you go off and try to say that I'm just making some crazy statement, I want you to keep in mind this guy is very well respected and have been around for half a century. So I'll go one further. So most judges and lawyers are Masons, and Masonry is this system of Satan. So what does that mean? Draw the line through. The system is satanic. What am I talking about the system? I'm saying the United States government system is satanic. It's the new Babylon. It's mystery Babylon. So anybody that knows the Bible, look up, or doesn't look up the Bible, just look up mystery Babylon. That's what you got here. So I can never expect it to do the right thing. It's, 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 that's its exact mirror opposite to its nature. So uh, it's like act, asking a dog to be a duck. The May 27th SEC update is posted. Um, both parties asking to extend two months to work out final details. Okay, that's read it for yourself. A few final details. That's what it says. So the lines are being strong, drawn more starkly every day. This goes back to what I remember uh, Jeff Hazlett saying from Hero Club, which I didn't really understand the significance of it at the time, but it's becoming more clear every day. Pick a side, pick a side, pick a side. So the NRA, which is a gun sales organization, not a gun rights organization, a gun sales and promotion marketing organization, holds a gun sales and marketing promotion rally right after a, a school massacre in Texas. You know, it's like God is trying to just keeps bringing the fire closer and closer, trying to, to show with the incredible patience that he has, um, you know, bring bring the matter closer and closer to the people who need to see it, and yet they don't see it. So you, you have this I I incredibly awful school massacre in Texas, and then you have a gun sales rally right after that. <laughs> nice job, reprobates. Uh, you're just making it cl more clear and cl more clear and more clear and more clear every day. Um, it's just, it's, uh, frankly, it's baffling to me. I just, it's, there's no words for this. So Judge Carden, the same one that um, wouldn't allow me to s defend myself, um, even let me buy tickets to California and make travel plans only to tell me I could only show up and watch my lynching from the galley, not defend myself. You know, let me tell you what, bud, you're a human being and not much of one either, I must say. You are going to pay for every ruling like this you've ever done to anybody. Okay, big shot. So he told this guy that built this giant monstrosity of a um, castle in California, uh, ruled against him, and the guy said he's a uh, racist or against his religion or something. Same guy, okay? Well, he turns around and tells the media, well, everyone has their First Amendment rights to speak. Really? Really? <laughs> Apparently that doesn't, that doesn't apply to me, does it, jackass? You're going to get yours, bud. I promise you, you will. I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid of any human being on this earth. Okay? Nobody. Macau's casino losses are skyrocketing with no quick fix in sight. Good. Gambling is for losers. It did not win, end well for Judas in the Bible. Judas, the guy, the silver pieces, this, this applies to a few folks amongst us. It's not going to end well for you either. Judas, goats that you are. A mass shooting a day. Wow. Actually, I think it's two. Did we have two yesterday? Yeah, this is this is <clears throat> it's not sustainable, and the economy is about to completely implode, just like I said it would a year ago. I said a year ago in the summer of 2022. So, strike that one as another win because it will be. It'll happen exactly as I said. Said so the housing market will come apart. 
inflation will go way up because there's no way around it and um, all the stimulus runs out, which is what was causing the inflation and, and the false appearance of prosperity, which now results in, you know, it all disappears, the rugs pull out from underneath and then everything comes crashing down. So, awful lot of shootings. You think there might be a connection there? I promise you there's a connection. Johnny Depp versus Amber Heard, which, by the way, were at the first party that I attended in 2015 when I got to California. I didn't know it at the time. I knew Johnny was there because he's right next to us in, in the before he went up on stage to perform with the uh, Hollywood Vampires. But I didn't know Amber was there. She was there also. Didn't know who she was at the time. So found some pictures. Um, that's just kind of strange. So <clears throat> previously... Um, I thought that I would actually uh, try to get involved in the ref in the reforming of the legal system through maybe uh, software, um, replacing lawyers with software. Um, that that can that listen that can never happen even under the best of circumstances technically because the people that control the levers of power are not going to allow it. So, um, rather than than that uh, angle. Uh, I'm I'm just going to leave it to its own devices. It will end up destroyed in a trash heap on the ground because God will destroy it. I'm not going to even bother with it. Its its days are numbered. It's going to die on its own. So the point of influence is um, not for me uh, going forward. It's not going to be the law. It's going to be um, through uh, the entertainment field. So that's where I'm going to focus my attention because nobody pays attention. I mean, everyone pays attention to entertainment and the legal system is so profoundly sick. It's got terminal cancer and, uh, you know, I'm not going to put my time and resources uh, and efforts behind trying to reform it. I'm just going to watch it die and I'm going to dance on the grave when it happens. Am I talking sharply? You better believe it. I've been through 15 years of watching how the legal system actually works and watching where the points of influence are and where the incentive structures are and what's in control of it and all that stuff. And yeah, I am I am absolutely categorically done. And I'll say this once again. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Unless you have a an arrest warrant or a warrant, which I will have inspected, Unless you're producing a warrant, get out of my life. I'm warning you. And I'm armed. So don't be knocking on my door unless you have a valid warrant, which I will verify before anything happens. Don't, don't even try it. I am done. You are evil. Okay? Your system is of the devil. It's of Satan. It's proven itself to me. I was very skeptical. Of these claims. I saw these claims a long, long time ago. I saw these claims a long time ago and I scoffed at it. I scoffed at it. I was the Boy Scout. I'm like, no, I could, it couldn't possibly be that. Well, it is. I've been through the process of dealing with it and watching how it operates and watching how it handles things, not just my stuff, other people's stuff and big public events and absolutely it is a system of Satan, so it will end up where it belongs, in the lake of fire. So that's all, folks. Thank you for listening, and I'll speak with you again in two weeks. Bye now.